Hey gang, it's Jay. We are ready to rock and roll. We've got some keyword research under our belt, and we're actually going to create a video uh, for our Pinup Girl costume website uh, in real time here today. Uh, it's going to take about 20 25 minutes. Let's get going. It's going to be a ton of fun. Uh, here I am at Google homepage. I'm going to animoto.com. This is one of my favorite tools, period. Uh, this is a great website. Um, you are going to be amazed. If you've never seen uh, the videos that this website creates uh, out of basically nothing, uh, you're going to flip your lid. You can go ahead and you can uh, use this for free. Uh, I think you're limited to a 30 second video if you do that. The paid membership started at something crazy like 30 bucks a year. Uh, so it's super cheap, very powerful. Let's get going. Click on create a video. This is our theme page. Uh, this is the generic one that I use that most times. Uh, they also have some cool new ones that they just came out with. <clears throat> Pardon, this one's called Fire. I've never used it. I think it's going to look pretty cool with our Halloween costume website. Let's see how it looks. So this is it. This is super, super easy to use. Start by clicking the upload button. Uh, this is a file of pictures that I actually pulled off of my uh, buy costume site, the vendor site that. Uh, that I'm, I'm an affiliate for. So what I usually do to get going is I just get all of the still photos, if I have any video, I get it all on the page uh, at the same time. So it's easy to do. Go ahead and click on the pictures. You'll see it uh, added to the screen there. So I say super easy to do. Add more. Here we have six. Add more, a couple more, I'd say. Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pictures. Uh, that is going to create, once we have our titles in there, it's going to create about a 60 to 90 um, second video depending on the music that we choose. It syncs to the music, what if it's a fast uh, tempo, slow tempo. So um, you really don't want to get too much longer than that uh, or people will start falling asleep even if it's a cool video. So I've got all my pictures lined up here and what I usually do uh, here is get all my uh, titles added as well. And that's easy to do. You go ahead and uh, just click this, click this Add Text widget on the bottom. And I usually space them out. I go Picture, Title, Picture, Title, Picture, Title. So I'm just clicking on every picture. And it's adding a title immediately after that. OK. Now starts the fun part. We've got our, so we have basically all our text modules, all our pictures. This is how it's going to lay out. I just kind of threw them up there, and uh, let's see what we can uh, we can make a video out of this here. I've got our notepad with our keyword research words on here. Now I want to start out uh, by uh, mentioning our search term exactly in this first. Uh, text uh, title module here. So our search term is, of course, pinup girl costumes. I, I, uh, it's good to start out with a question. I'm going to say something like, "Looking for pinup girl costumes this Halloween." Well, you see that you're limited to. Let me finish typing this here. I can type much faster if I'm not talking. Okay, now as you can see, uh, you're limited to uh, 22 characters up top and 30 characters in the bottom, a total of 52 characters. Doesn't seem like much, but it's actually just the perfect amount. And you'll see afterwards, um, it ends up being like these little kind of marketing haikus there. And it, any more is, uh, is, is too much in my, in my opinion. So. Go ahead and click done for that first one. Uh, here's the first image that'll come up. Let me see. I usually proceed the. Uh, I I look to the next picture and sort of try to uh, create some.
text that goes along with it. So this is going to be the upcoming one. I want the text to come up before the picture. So this is kind of a, a vintage looking, I don't know what she is, she's like a cigarette girl or something. Let's look at our, let's look at our keywords here. Vintage style dresses, look at this. Okay, I'm going to include this. So you basically, you're just loading up the text with keywords, and Google sees this. They can translate whatever they see on the screen in a video and say, hey, that's a ton of keywords. I'm going to rank this highly. So it, it's almost just like, uh, like article marketing uh, in that way. So vintage style dresses. Okay, so here's our picture. I'm going to say uh, something like, do you love the look of vintage, vintage style dresses? Let's see if that fits here. Question mark. Great. Here's our next picture. Not sure what that looks like. Let's see if we can find a match with our keywords. Burlesque costumes. That looks something like a burlesque costume. I'm going to copy that. Go back down here and say something like, how about a sexy burlesque costume this year? Great, done. Next picture. That's like a sailor suit. Here's our keywords. Sailor girl costume. I'm gonna copy that and say we could say something like uh, ready to turn heads in a sailor girl costume. Dot dot dot. done. Okay, this is an army. It's, these costumes kill me. Okay, something army, army, army. What do we have here? <clears throat> okay, now we didn't include uh, anything specifically army costume related here, but we'll just say, uh, or maybe you feel like next line an army brat instead dot 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 I put this down here spot right okay next picture that looks like a poodle skirt or something like that. Okay, look at this, 50 style clothing. That's a keyword that we found off of the AdWords search that we did. And we can say something like, if you're looking for Retro 50 style clothing. Dot dot dot. Okay. Here's our next picture. I uh, don't know <coughs> what that is. Um, but at this point, we're wrapping it up. So if if this was if you're looking for retro 50 style clothing, how about uh, You've come to the right. Whoop, I can't put that on that line. The right place. Okay, our last picture. I don't know what you would call that girl, but in any case, we're just going to say, we're going to wrap it up. Uh, say find all these pinup girl Halloween costumes here if that fits on this line something like that pinup
Now notice I used this, I'm, I did the PINUP one word pin up here. Change up the spelling. Google will notice that. Halloween costumes. Whoop up up here. Find all these pinup girl Halloween costumes here. What if we capitalize this? Pinup girl. Done. Okay, I'm going to add one more text widget there and just put my URL. Pinup girl costume costumes.org and sign off and just say see you there exclamation okay I'm gonna do a little spell check here looking for pinup girl costumes is Halloween question mark let's see if I fit there great do you love the look of vintage style dresses there you go how about a sexy burlesque costume this year Ready to turn heads in a sailor girl costume? Yes. Or maybe you feel like an army brat instead. If you're looking for retro 50 style clothing, you've come to the right place. Find all these pinup girl Halloween costumes here. And there's our URL. See you there. Done. Okay. I'm calling that good. I'm going to click done here. It's going to take us to the music selection uh, process here. Something up tempo, maybe Latin. You can do a little, uh, it plays you a little snippet. Hey, that's okay called Incendio. All right, I'm going to select that. And we're going to save and continue. Finalize. Uh, everything looks okay here. Continue. Our title is going to be our search term. And our description, I always like to start off our, our the description with the URL. .org and something like uh, find the perfect pinnacle girl costumes. For Halloween. Yeah, so we're going to want to put some uh, some keywords in this uh, in this description here. This one is not as important as when we actually go and uh, distribute this. So I'm just going to wrap it up here and say uh, find the perfect pinup girl costumes for Halloween. Right here. Dot dot dot. Just click on the link above. Now that's why it's important to have this link here. Uh, not all the uh, video distribution sites will let you uh, go ahead and, and uh, include a link, an outgoing link to your website, but some of them do. And uh, you're definitely going to want that uh, up front there. Some of them will only give you, you know, 30 characters visible. So you want to have that right there. If they, if they let you display that, that's what you're going to want there end of the video button. Uh, this is what, uh, there's going to be, uh, be a button that comes on at the end of this here. I'll show you. <clears throat> it's going to say um, something like uh, click here for more pinup girls. And that button is going to send them to the website. And here's our, put our URL in here again. Pretty slick. 
Our thumbnail looks good. Okay, go ahead and create the video. So this is going to go ahead and crunch uh, the images that we put in there, crunch the title text and the music, and sync it to the music. Uh, it takes about 10 or 15 minutes to complete that, and I'm just going to pause it until it's done, and I'm going to come back and show you what our video looks like. See you soon. Hey gang, we're back here. It looks like our video is complete here. Yeah, I'm kind of excited to see what this new theme looks like. Here we go. Hey, that works. I'm liking that theme. I think I'm going to use that for all of my uh, future Halloween costume videos that I make. Here's that button that I was telling you guys about. Now this is how uh, it's monetized. Now go ahead and click on that button and it takes you right to the website. Pretty slick. So uh, we've we've created a website it's optimized with all of the keywords that Google told us that um, it wants us to include in it if we want to rank for uh, pinup girl costumes and in the next video we're going to we're almost ready to upload it to YouTube but before we do that we're going to create a Gmail account and I'll tell you why in the next video see you there